What's up, guys? <laughs> What's up, Camillo? How you doing, bud? You guys had a good week? It's been ages since we've hung out, eh? You ready for some more sleeping dogs today? I am. I've been waiting all week to play this. Nice. Was it a good training session? Was it hard? Trenched in sweat by the end? Or what did you guys work on? Oh dude, that's exciting. What uh, what rank is that? Hey, Zell, what's going on, bud? Should we uh, should we put the game on? Should we put into some sleeping dogs? <laughs> what kind of katas do Goju do? Like, what kata are you working on? Okay. Hey, what's up, Malik? Oh, Zell says wait. <laughs> Zell just wants to beat me up in Mortal Kombat on stream. That's what he wants to do. <laughs> Alright. Ah, let's go. Hey, so. This is my first time ever playing it. And it's so much fun. I gotta say. Oh yeah, San Chen. I never did, uh, I never did Cypher, but I had a friend who did it. He did Zendo Kai Karate and he did, uh, Cypher. Alright. So last week we busted into the karaoke place, beat up a bunch of guys, and then we got the, uh, Wukong suit. Hey, Abracadabra, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> ah, I know. I'm sorry. Reagan was uh, had a friend here, and then she was sick, so I had to uh, had to look after the classes for her on Tuesday. It's a little bit weird having me teach the women's only classes, but it's fun. All right. I kind of forgot what we were doing. I remember the karaoke thing, but I don't remember why. I haven't played this since last week, as you guys can tell. Can't even drive in a straight line. <laughs> I'm sorry if I seem a little bit tired today too guys I uh I get to go train with my trainer once a week and it's on Thursdays oh I used to run the women's class back at the old gym uh, I ran it for years but uh since we moved into the new gym and Reagan's teaching it's just I don't do it very often now because it's her thing uh, it was fun though. They were a really fun bunch of ladies. I really do enjoy teaching them. But uh, yeah, I uh, went and trained with my coach today, and he beat the crap out of me. So <laughs> I'm uh, I'm feeling it today for sure. I just realized we don't have a little chat box here. Oh, there we go. Good. Okay. I thought we didn't have a chat box. But now I made him sweat, made him work hard. It was a good time. They all left smiling. They all left happy. <laughs> all right. I missed what we're doing. I just I want to get. To, apparently, there's some like Mortal Kombat style tournament in this game, where you unlock a bunch of really cool costumes. I just want to check that out. Oh yeah, he put you through some work, eh, Camillo? That's what coaches do best. Mine, uh, I just started fight camp. I'm not fighting anytime soon, but uh, I'm going through the motions, kind of just trying to get back in shape. And so my coach took it to me today. Beat me up with the pads. Anytime he hit me, I had to do 15 burpees. So I had to do like 90 burpees or something in total. And then he finished it off with like 200 push ups.
Uh, no, the tournament, I did get the DLC because I got the Definitive Edition. Oh, I'm definitely not watching this guy's suspicion level. Let's just hang around. I'd be pretty suspicious if a van full of chickens was following me, to be honest. Yeah, I got the DLC. Isn't it like a zombie DLC too? Whoop. Alright. Maybe we'll, uh, after a few of these missions, maybe we'll go check that out, eh? Chinese vampires. <laughs> I've been trying not to play this too much off stream. I did uh, a couple of like the little security camera missions just to get some some money, but that was about it. Bouncing vampires? What? Uh. Oh, camera. Okay. Is that him? There we go. Well, we'll have to give it a go for sure. <laughs> I I did I did not know that hopping vampires were like a Chinese uh, folklore thing. Oh, do we get him? Oh, okay. That's a cool little like twist on the classic story, hey? Draining your chi rather than drinking blood. <laughs> it's a very fine line, Dylan. I agree. Super fine line. That's why uh, I don't enjoy a lot of horror movies because they often they don't uh, know how to walk that line a lot of the time. And they end up just being hilariously ridiculous. Oh. Oh, that's my car. Is it? Yes. I think we get to break this guy, uh, this guy's knee. <clears throat> I remembered how to do the knee break though, just from last week. Oh. <laughs> Tucker and Dale versus Evil? Is that like a... It sounds almost like an Ash versus Evil Dead thing. Hey, Mike, what's up, buddy? Ooh, yes, another statue, guys. Hell yeah. I wonder what we get to unlock this time. <laughs> what's up, love? I have, uh, I have friends who really like to watch horror movies, so maybe I'll make them watch it with us. Where even is he? Is that him over there? Not much love, we just started buddy. We've been going maybe 10 minutes. Oh no, I was alright. Regan was uh... Regan was a little bit sick so she couldn't... Couldn't teach so I just had to jump in and run the class for her, that's all. She just wasn't feeling well and with everything going on you know it's... You gotta be careful. <laughs> I've never seen Twilight Zone, Camillo. Shaun of the Dead's great. Oh, she's fine now, yeah, yeah. She's fine, she has a bit of a cough, and just with things going on, you know, you can't, can't go anywhere if you have a cough, so she stayed home. She's fine now. Ooh. Come on, just give me a mission where I get to break people's knees, that's all I want. Oh, that's good. I'm glad you didn't uh, didn't dislocate his arm. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, well, Lou. Oh. Got something stuck in my throat. <clears throat> oh. Oh, jeez. Hot fuzz is amazing. What's up, Ryujin? How you doing, bud? Had a good week? Wait, really? Tucker and... Which one's that one? Oh. Oh my god, I don't know what happened there. I pressed the ram button and he just like drove off the side of the road. Paul is a good one too. Dude, fighting is fun. I agree. Fighting with a referee is much better. But fighting is a good time. Oh. What is this music? Uh, I can't just outrun this guy. God, these cops are like hard to ditch. Anything uh, Simon Pegg and Nick Frost is a great movie. Anything with those two is amazing. Oh, has he done it? Has he done it? Come on, almost there, almost there. Yes. Done. Oh, Twilight Zoners. <laughs> right? Yeah, referees are there to stop people dying. That's what referees do. Oh, did anyone watch the UFC on the weekend? I'm kind of digging the classic music, to be honest. So much property damage, though. Get out of here. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, anyone watch uh, the UFC? Do you see the Ortega Volkanovski fight? Uh, oh, I'm going backwards now. I'm not focusing on where I'm going. Nope, this way apparently. Okay. Uh, Nate Diaz did a lot better than I was expecting, I'll be honest, considering how long he's been out of it. He looks pretty good. Um, the, the Ortega Volkanovski fight was insane, though. Absolutely nuts. Definitely a fight of the year contender for sure. If you guys get a chance, check it out. How's school going, love? Do you guys want fish balls? I don't think I do. Oh. Hey, there we go. Yeah, he fought a uh, half Thor. He fought Devin Lorat, who is a, a world like arm wrestling champion. Oh, hey, uh, Ryu Jin. Let me show you something. Uh, how do I? Where's my trophy list? I haven't played it in a while, but oh, jeez, it has been a while, hey. Dun, 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 dun. Jeez, okay. I was hoping it would be a little bit higher than this. There it is. I have platinum to Ghost of Tsushima. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Regan's an accountant and she won't let me write it off, so I'm not allowed to. I loved it, dude. I haven't bought the DLC yet, but I was. Uh, it's on my list of ones that I really want to play. I do want to check out the DLC for that. Yeah, his name's uh, Half Thor Bjornsson, and he's 400 pounds. Have you, well, not now he's not. He's like 300 pounds or something like that. But uh, have you guys seen his wife? She's like a 110-pound Australian girl. She's tiny. I do get to write off some pretty cool stuff, though. Uh, I do get to write off some pretty cool stuff as an instructor, though. Oh, I did I did a couple today. So I did uh, Nola and Burton from Banshee. Um, and then I also did uh, Denzel Washington from The Equalizer. 
<laughs> That's true, Dylan, yeah. I imagine big dudes can be, but he's not. He's built like a rock. Dude, the Nola... Well, so I'm... I watched it, not really knowing what to expect. And then, uh... Um... Got really thrown off by the ending. If you guys have seen the ending, you'll know what I'm talking about to that fight. But uh, the frame rates are all wonky. The frame rates are all wacky. So when I edited it to try and upload it, it, it just it's not working. So uh, I have to go back and try and fix that and see if I can work out how to fix the frame rates on stuff. Uh, but I'm hoping after the live stream, I'm going to edit that and get that one out. Yes, only the strong will... Uh, Oh god, like I said, the Equalizer, um, the Nola and Burton fight, um, SPL3 Paradox, uh, fight scene from that one, and also a Chuck Norris one are on the list. <laughs> I've never seen the Equalizer, Dylan, so I don't know. This uh, reaction to the Equalizer is going to be the first time I've ever seen it. I do like Denzel Washington, though. But uh, yeah, Eddie. Um, <laughs> any cutscene with this outfit, though, it's hilarious. Oh really? Actually, I think I remember hearing that. That gun looks so fake. It looks like just like a plastic Nerf gun. <laughs> um, Eddie Hall and Half Thor are going to fight. That's going to be crazy. Two world strongest man winners. Boxing. It's going to be insane. Oh. <laughs> I guess it wasn't a nerf gun. This game is brutal, man. I love it. I'm not normally like a... A huge open world game person but this one's good so it's gonna take us six months to get through it Zell is that what you're playing uh playing saying playing it for like an hour a week you might have to do a second stream <laughs> a fake nerf gun who's actually a real gun that's whole other levels man the Fluffy's good. She was out here a little bit. I gave her some yogurt and now she's uh, gonna hit under the bed. If she comes out here. I was gonna make a pun and be like, speaking of sleeping dogs, here she is. But uh, she's under the bed, unfortunately. Alright, where to next, boys? Ping's PC. Alright. Actually, a buddy of mine and I are going to start watching The Sopranos, because I've never seen it. And he says it's the greatest show ever. So him and I are going to start watching that, just for an excuse to hang out. Alright, where are we going, guys? Are we going to uh, Police Case, Death by a Thousand Cuts? Ooh. What's up, Keandre? Or uh, Listening In? I think we have to go Death of a Thousand Cuts, right? Yeah? You guys with me? Is that, um... Wait, there's a nerf gun that's a flamethrower? What? I thought you were talking about, uh... Elon Musk's, like, not a flamethrower gun for a second. But what do you mean? There's a nerf gun that's a flamethrower. Just spews out nerf darts in a constant stream? Oh, I guess we could have taken a gun, hey? Have you watched The Irishman, Zell? I think it's called The Irishman on Netflix. There's a movie of The Sopranos? Alright, which one are we taking, guys? Ooh, The Somersault Cloud. Yep. <gasps> ah, it's Nimbus. <laughs> That's awesome. Freestyle sport karate demonstrations? I mean, for sure, I'll give them a look. Anyone in particular? I love that this is the Nimbus, by the way. I 
I know, right? I just want to go in and just fight people. That's what I want. Oh, so should we avoid it then, Dylan? Like, is it going to be boring to watch? Is that what it's going to be? Because I will avoid it. Oh well, I'm not going to avoid these guys. Yes, take that. That's right, you gotta grapple these guys. I gotta remember how to do like the takedown now. Oh, I can't remember the takedown, unfortunately. And I'm rocking the Dragon Ball t-shirt too today. <laughs> all right let's see if i rage all right dylan let's see if i rage i i actually really like mafia movies to be honest i'm trying to think of some of the ones that i've watched lately but i was trying to think how many movies i've watched in the last year and i think i can count them on both hands like i think i've watched less than 10 movies this year oh is there more people to fight Yes. This is my favorite one. That sweep is my favorite. Oh, I forgot about the counters. There we go. Oh, ah, damn it. Yes. <laughs> yeah, my um, The Departed. I actually, uh, I rarely we re rewatch movies, but I've seen The Departed like three or four times. That movie is incredible. <laughs> Oh jeez, poisoned blades? What? So I feel like this is just a counter attack. Damn it. Ah, I was I was mashing triangle. Damn it. See you, Mike, have a good night, bud. I kind of, I'll be honest with you, I kind of forgot the buttons. <laughs> I definitely forgot the buttons there for a sec. <laughs> ah. I've never seen Godfather. Ever. It's like always on my list uh, on Netflix to watch. Come on. Oh, he does it twice. Okay. Gotta remember that. Damn it. The cleaver is brutal. Come on, bud, just try it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Try it, dude. Oh, shit. Oh, no, there's more. Come on, dude, let's go. Come on. Let's see what you got. Oh, I dodged that one too, for sure. One, two, one, two, three. Oh, all three of them in one. That like flash is annoying. Two, ah, one, two, three. Oh, I didn't mean to grab, whoops. Oh no, I lost my knife. Did he take it? Oh, we're doing so well too. Oh no. Ah, all right. 
I feel like this is gonna be a tough one. I know, right? How, was I close? Was I close? Or was he still like a mile away? One, one, two, three. Dodge. One, two, three. Yes. Come on, bud. Just try it. I dare you. There we go. What do you got, son? Dodge. Oh, I thought that was twice. Dodge. Oh, he spun twice. Yo. No spin for you. There we are. Ah, oh, does it twice. I gotta remember that. One. One. Two. What? I guess. Okay, I can't mash triangle. Just to press it when I see red. One. Two. The second one's hard to dodge. The timing is is weird. Oh. <laughs> I can't do the uh the, the power pole boat of flying daggers. <laughs> ah. One. No. Oh, okay. No knife for you. Good. What? How did I. How did I get hit by that one? I dodged it, then I got him back. Can I just, like, hit him? Is my blade poison too? The lean back is sick. Oh. oh, come on. No. No. I'm doing worse. Oh, that one's hard. I can't get the timing for it. Damn. <laughs> Wukong is not good for this one. Good. All right. I don't normally rage in games like this though, because the only reason I'm dying is my own fault. It's not not like it's the game. The, like, back kick doesn't stop him, though. Oh, come on. Oh, it's hard because you got to be on the offensive the whole time. Oh, I wasn't watching. I looked away. <laughs> you know, this might have to be one that we come back to. One more try. One more try. All right, here we go, guys. This is it. I feel it. This is the one. This is the one. Yes. Just slow and steady. Oh, no. All right. That's it. We done. No. Oh. Second one gets me every time. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> I failed. I did not become the one. I did not become the one. I'm sorry. I let you all down. One more, one more try. 
One more, one more try. Ah. I don't have the weapon grab, unfortunately, so I'm just literally mashing square <laughs> and triangle. That's it. And mashing triangle does not work, apparently. So this is not our try, guys. This is not our try. Oh, run. Damn it, beat me to it. No. <laughs> okay. Third time's the charm? Hey, I think so. I think third time's the charm. This is the last one. This is absolutely the last one. We're just gonna go in there and we're just gonna get you. Really? Hit him with the power attack and he doesn't even go down. Okay. There we go. What's up, William? How you doing, bud? Oh no. Just stood there and took those ones. Hey! What did we get that for? Hey, you should be scared. Ah, come on. Face the other way, you idiot. <laughs> there we go. Fine. Oh, I just missed. 13 of 30, that's it? Is there a dodge button? That's the thing, I don't think there is. I mean, I'm pressing all the buttons. I'm pressing all the buttons and there is not a dodge. Yeah. <laughs> ah. Alright. <laughs> I'm sorry guys. I've let you down. I've let you down. I'm sorry. Tell you what. Before we finish up tonight, we'll head back and we'll try that one more time. The countering the two is hard. I can't just like mash. Let's go unlock a new uh, ability. Let's see. Oh, there's no cars. I guess. Oh, can we get that one? Oh, this guy will do. Is this guy just like flexing on himself? Cool. Yes, it's no Nimbus, but it'll do. Whoa. Oh. All right, so we got to get the. Uh... <laughs> we have to get the uh, the weapon disarm, hey? And then we just disarm everybody and throw it at them. I was getting stabbed left, right, and center in that thing. Oh. The controls kind of remind me of The Witcher 3 a little bit. There's like a little bit of delay, and he'll just kind of like go wherever he wants to. I found one of your statues. The snake. Oh, four out of I 12. Understand. I understand your sister passed. She was an addict. She couldn't kick it. It's not a very interesting story. Jeez, that's rough. Suppose, though in light of that, Chosen career is rather interesting. To me, anyway. <laughs> you asked me once not to lie. Stir fry me up. Serve me up for dinner. You shouldn't ask me about my career. 
Fair enough. I like that, like, this game isn't... Like, most uh, open world what games, like, kind of lack some challenge, right? This one is hard. Ooh, disarm tackle. X and... Oh, okay, X and circle. That was the one. Double jump kick. Uh, okay, we have to go up to the arm break one for sure. Wait, we have... Oh, oh, hey, look, we have the, uh, the disarm tackle now. Does that mean we can handle these guys? Handle the, uh, death of a thousand cuts? Yes. This is my, this might be my favorite one, though. Just that double leg. Oh. Are these guys going to keep on getting back up, or do I need to just, like, beat them up now? I wonder how many times he'll get up if I break his leg. I still don't want to watch that one though. I'm just going all GSP on him, man. Double leg, hit him with the ground and pound. That's it. All right, we have the weapon, the disarm tackle now. Okay, where to next, guys? We're gonna head down here to listening in. Let's do it. I haven't watched rugby in forever, Camillo. I remember when I was younger, my dad took me to see uh, Australia versus South Africa game, and that was awesome. It was so much fun. No, I haven't done the fight clubs yet. They're in uh, DLC, right? That's what um, these guys were saying in the chat, is that the fight club's in the DLC. Should we go and give those a go? Maybe, maybe we'll go back and give a thousand cuts one more try. Or is that like a special outfit that might help us with it, maybe? Oh, okay. Are you Ping? No, there's no Ping. How about the owner, then? I'm the owner. Just not ping. <laughs> All right, not ping. I'm coming up <laughs> with you know it? Orange Lotus. Sure. Dude, I, I my favorite rugby team to watch though is for sure the Fijian or the Samoan teams. Oh, okay. Uh, when do we unlock those, Dylan? Like, is can we go there now, or is it something we need to like play through a little bit more? Hey, well, this is perfect. We disarm tackle this dude. Oh, why? Get up. Oh, stupid rock. Out of the way. <laughs> Come on, up you get. Tackle him off the roof. Which way is he going? Oh, he deked me out. Hey, Alicia. Oh, I almost... Ah! <laughs> I almost didn't see him. I was looking at the chat. There you go. Get back up here, bud. Hey. Yes. My tote bag. Thank you very much. It's good, Alicia. It's fun. You watched me uh, getting my butt kicked by a bunch of... Oh. Bunch of mobsters. I don't know what I skipped. Is that it? What do we have to do now? Oh, okay. Sorry, I guess I skipped that. Phone, reports. What am I supposed to do with this thing? Oh, okay, there we go.
No shit. <laughs> oh no, don't tell me this has like a stealth section in it. This game is not designed for stealth. Ooh, that looks fast. Hi. Thank you very much. Out of my way, lady. <laughs> There's no rocks in the middle of the hallway to trip you over in this game, though, Alicia. Final Fantasy VII for life. I love your name, by the way. Um, I've only been playing it on stream, so maybe like three hours, I think, is about all I've been playing for. Tonight, about about half hour, 40 minutes, I think. <laughs> Whoop! I don't want to steal that car. That was a nice one to drive. I've been playing a lot of uh, remake, Final Fantasy VII Remake Integrade this week. Oh. Okay. Here we go. I mean, I've been looking for a good game to play. And this is kind of scratching the itch. But it's only been a couple hours now. Really? Okay, do we just run and jump? Yep. Nice. I feel like we're still in like the tutorial stage of this game. That's what I feel like. Because they're still introducing us to a lot of stuff. Go to the end of the area and stand on the square and the thugs won't get you? Oh, health regeneration and stocking up on dragon punches is a great idea. I didn't even think of that. Hey, has anyone here played Final Fantasy VII Remake Integrade? Out of curiosity? Good. Ooh, we got the jumpsuit. Oh. The combat in it is amazing, but it's so hard. You got something to say, talk. I will, and us. Um, I've been wanting to. I've actually done the, yeah, the, the DLC for the Final Fantasy VII remake. I've actually done a bunch of uh, Itman stuff, but it always gets blocked. Anything Donnie Yen just gets blocked, like immediately, and does not get shown. Hey, another Jade statue. Yes. We're getting close to learning the dim mark, boys. Oh. <laughs> Dude, I loved it. The combat's so good, but uh, there's one secret boss that I have not been able to beat yet. And that is uh, Weiss the Immaculate. Oh. What am I supposed to do here? Ah. Well, this has not been very intuitive. There is some seriously unintuitive stuff in this game, though, I will say. Uh, no, I haven't seen it. Uh, yes, yeah, Scott Adkins. I'll definitely do some more Scott Adkins. I've done a lot of, like, Undisputed and stuff with him on the channel. Uh, I want to do him and Kane Kasugi in Ninja Assassin. So I've heard good things about that. Okay, that one was a little bit easier. <laughs> I imagine he probably has. Have I shown you guys his stuff? 
You should check out him. If you like really heavy stuff, you should check him out. Alright. Well, are we gonna go... Oh, let's... Let's head back down to the dojo. We're right here. Yeah, DJ is amazing. He plays in a band called Without Mercy. Yeah, uh, I've done a, few, done a bit of Michael J. White. I'll do some more of him stuff as well. Uh, I've got... Five, four or five kind of lined up for the next little bit. I have a few to edit tonight, so there should be another one coming out later. Um, and then... Uh, hopefully next week we can do Anime Week. Yeah, right? That That's so intense, Manzel. That's such a crazy uh, film clip. That's actually the first reaction that I ever did was to that, was to that video. Because he asked me to do one for their like album release. Um, he just wanted reactions to the to the end of the video, and so he asked me to do one, and that was what he was like, "Hey, you should do a reaction video." So I was like, "Okay." Yeah, I want to do um, uh, Seki Bayashi and the Sumo Wrestler from that one. <laughs> I'm glad you like it, man. Yeah, I just I just wanted to be like you know hanging out with friends and watching movies. That's all. Hatsumi Sen, yes, that was good. Oh, yes. It was uh Chun Sekibayashi and the um, the sumo wrestler, right? What's his name? Come on, get up. Boom, 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 there we go. Is this guy just gonna keep on taking these shots or do I just finish him off now? No, I haven't seen Food Wars. I guess I need to keep on. I was looking for a new anime to get into on, uh, jeez, on Netflix. I was gonna watch, um, Iron Blooded Orphans, I think it is. It's a Gundam one. I've never seen Gundam. Oh, that's awful. And us, I will always say... Uh, Muay Thai. 100%. Why can't... Why can't I stun this guy? Unless... I'm holding circle. Kyozan. That's right. Yeah, Kyozan and Sekibayashi. Is he getting, why isn't this working? I did the stun thing. Oh, okay, I see. I have to like let him get into this. There we go. Okay. Uh, no, I haven't watched Megalobox. That one's on my list though. Worth the watch, Dylan? Oh, was not looking. It's a bit unfair to beat up a yellow belt when you're supposedly a master at this stuff. Although I'm not making him look very good right now. Oh, that one's so good. There we go. Forever, Anas. You'll be learning it forever. Yu Yu Hakusho is not on Netflix. Oh, actually, I have a VPN now. So I can watch American Netflix. Maybe they've got some better stuff. I do like boxing. So yeah, Megalobox. And I know that like the whole series is on Netflix as well. So maybe Megalobox will be the one that I check out. Um, and then I've been trying to find like Hajime no Ippo. Because I'd love to watch that too. Um, yeah, I might end up doing that to be honest. Uh, Samurai Champloo. I have on my laptop, so I haven't I haven't watched it yet, but uh, Samurai Champloo is on my laptop. Uh, Alright, where are we going? I guess the police. Can we go this way? Yes, we can. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I really should just renew my Crunchyroll subscription, to be honest. Creed was a good movie. Yeah, I've watched like the first episode of Samurai Champloo and it was beautiful. It was gorgeous. I just don't normally um, 
watch stuff on my laptop. I don't normally watch stuff in front of my uh, laptop because I don't like sitting here watching it. So I haven't watched Samurai Champloo, but maybe if I put it on my phone. Oh, Nas, I'm sorry, bud. I'm sorry to hear that, man. Getting in fights is not fun unless it's, you know, in the ring. Samu okay, Samurai Champloo versus Afro Samurai. Maybe we'll check that one out for uh, Anime Week. That'll be cool. I'm glad you're here. What do you know about the underground racing circuit? Well, they drive fast. Occasionally they crash into something. Yeah, and occasionally they end up... Yeah, people, people can suck, man. People can, uh... But these last couple of yeah, miles people can suck. Got more of a but uh, Muay Thai will definitely put you in a good way, and then Brazilian yeah. Jiu Jitsu as well uh, is another great one too. But just remember that uh, you know there are no rules in the street. There are rules in the ring, but there are no rules in the street. So uh, always got to keep that in mind. Oh, whoops. There we go. Okay. Call Ace. Oh, I have to check out GoGo Go Anime because I've been looking for stuff to watch. The only thing that I don't like uh, with like watching Netflix on anime is that they don't always have the whole series on there. That's the only thing, right? So, uh, you know, I hate like getting into it. Like Attack on Titan, like I've watched the first season of Attack on Titan like twice, but I haven't watched any more. And I know it's just getting Crunchyroll, but I just haven't been bothered. Yeah. I'm Wei. Wei Shen. You up for a race? Yeah, sure. Oh no. Oh no, guys. Oh, okay. Hey, health shrine. Yes, that's gonna help too. That's gonna help. Uh, yeah, I'm from Australia and us. I did watch a fair bit of Baki. I watched, um... I watched most of what they have on Netflix, and then I discovered Kengan Ashida, and then I fell in love with Kengan Ashida. I know, Attack on Titan's one I really want to watch. I really do just need to get a Crunchyroll subscription, because I like watching anime before bed. The only thing is though, because it's all subbed, I uh, end up falling asleep, because it's like reading. I end up falling asleep after like four minutes into the episode, so it'll take me a week to get through one episode. Oh, Nas, be careful, buddy. Look after yourself. <laughs> hey, even I'd feel safer having a weapon on me, for sure. <laughs> I can handle myself. I would still feel better having a weapon. Hey, as long as the knives are shorter than six inches, at least here in Canada, you're totally fine. Oh no, come on. I'm losing the lead. I'm losing the leaders. Did you guys walk to the cars together, Alicia? Yeah, absolutely, Final Fantasy VII. I, will, I am right there with you. Oh, Midnight Club was a good game. Whoop! Alright, there we go. Yeah, you can't trust Google for everything, buddy. Muay Thai is the best. No. Come on, man. These guys gave me a car that's too slow. Oh, no, 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 come on. 
Yes, take the inside. Takes him on the inside. Get out of here. No! No! No, get out of my way. I was doing so well. No, come on. Come on. Get out of my way. Yes, takes him at the last bit. Almost there. Sorry guys, I will catch up on chat in a sec. I'm just concentrating really hard. I'm terrible at racing games, but we're doing pretty well. Come on, come on, come on. Stay in the lead. Yes. Just. Woo, that was tense. Hey, Paper Mushrooms. Welcome to the channel, buddy. Thanks for coming and hanging out in the live stream. Glad you enjoyed the Punisher one. That was so good. <laughs> uh, no, I never played. Uh... Oh, dude, Keandre, that's cool. There's no Hapkido schools anywhere near me. Uh, I never played the Warriors, though, Beitor. Tokyo Revengers? Is that a movie? Come on, get out of the car. I want to steal one of these guys. I want to take that one. Uh, it's Salat. Uh, Salat style paper mushrooms. Oh, oh yes. Okay, it is an anime. Yes. I want this one. Should we go and check out a race? Uh, S I L A T. S uh, S I L A T. It's uh, and I think it was specifically Penchak Silat, P E N C A K, uh, S I L A T. I've heard Tokyo Revengers is really good. Yep, that's the one. There you go. Anasa's got it. Anasa's got it. He knows what's up. Uh, yeah, I, I would love to. Actually, one thing I, um, one thing I want to do, and I actually had a plan to go do it next week, was I want to go take lessons with instructors of different styles. And a friend of mine is a really, really good judo coach, and I was going to go take a lesson with him and film it and put it on the channel for you guys. Um, but we have here in BC now we have um like a vaccination passport. So you have to be vaccinated from COVID to be able to go anywhere. I have a, I'm not allowed to get vaccinated. My doctors told me I need to not get it just because I have some health complications right now. Uh, so I can't go and train with him now. So I can't do it. Mm. Anything that involves breakfast food, Dylan is the one. Yeah. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Dude, that's perfect. That's a perfect combination. There's also a Sistema school near me, so I can go and learn some no-touch stuff, which will be exciting. Yeah, it's also the reason I can't fight at the moment. <laughs> ah. Oh jeez. Okay, I was not concentrating on the big guy. Oh. Okay, this is not... <laughs> I was not concentrating on what I was doing. I kind of forgot how to fight the big guys. Uh, yeah, I just had, like I said, I just had some, uh, some, some health complications, and so we're just waiting to kind of get some answers before I go ahead, because my doctor thinks that the first shot kind of made me sick, unfortunately. Um, so... Yeah, it just kind of exas um, exacerbated some stuff I had going on, she thinks. So we're just going to hold off for a little bit. That's awesome, Paper Mushrooms. 
Hey Luke Martin, how you doing bud? Uh, he doesn't do online stuff unfortunately. Um, yeah, just in person. So, yeah, it, it's a shame because we we're going to go do it next week and then they kind of changed the rules a little bit so now I can't go into his gym, which, which sucks. Yeah, I heard, uh, I heard New Zealand was pretty rough. Um, because I heard that, like, Israel Adesanya had a hard time go going anywhere. That's gonna be good to stay safe. Alright. Yeah, that's good for him, man. Talented young kid. Hopefully he sticks with it. Hopefully he still likes training paper mushrooms. Hopefully he still, uh, still enjoys it. Oh. Ah, maybe he'll come back to it, right? He might come back to it. Yeah, so I know a bunch of people who had it. Um, even uh, Reagan had it too, and I didn't get sick. And we lived together, right? So I was in the same house, so for two weeks, I didn't get it. After the first shot, I got really sick, and then... Um, just for a day, but then I had a bunch of other stuff kind of come up. Um, and yeah, so just gotta, just gotta wait a little bit now. Hopefully... Hopefully we can work out exactly what it is, and uh, I can get back to training, and I can actually go and okay. do the lessons. I really need your help, please. What's wrong? It's, it's this. A gun. Yes. Charlie made me carry it in my but, purse. Eh, yeah. It's just a shame because I was actually really looking forward to seeing him because I haven't seen him in forever, so that was going to be really cool, and then now I can't. Yes. But is what it is, right? So in a way, the gun is yours too. Take it, won't you? Dude, judo guys are crazy strong. I think is this the first gun that we've got? Do you get guns in this game? Don't worry, dude. Like, I don't know, we've been playing for like three or four hours and we haven't got a gun yet. That's exciting enough. That's only like two weeks away, bud. Yeah, I know most people kind of get like a little bit sick the first time they get it, and then you know yeah. Pang. Wait, how did you get Charlie Pang's gun? Never mind. Can you use it? Right, meet me. I'm on the way. Uh, I've never done hapkido, but I did karate for a long time, Kiondre. So I like I like karate. <laughs> oh, how how do I say it? How do I say it? I'm so sorry. It's just it's just the letters there, so it's hard for me. Really? Oh, Anas. Okay. Oh. Yeah, just your immune system working it out, eh? Oh. I really need... Oh, I'm sorry. Whoops. Aido? That's cool. There's no Aido place near me. I did Shotokan Karate for about 10 years. And I loved every minute of it. The more people who train, the better, I think. I think everyone should train. Whoop, 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 whoop. Ah, oh man. Sometimes my accent makes it really hard for me to say names properly too. How long has he been training for? Andrew? What are you doing here? I mean like the thing is, like everyone thinks you need to be fit to train martial arts. You don't. That's how you get fit. Eido. I'm sure you've noticed the guns are something of a rarity in Hong Kong. I'm pronouncing everything wrong. Um, this particular gun is quite important. So who's the dead guy? Oh, I cool. Was you'd help me with that, actually. Yeah, dude. There's, like, you don't need to be fit to train, right? Don't need to be fit. Don't need to be strong. I hear. I I talk to a lot of people who come in, um, who call me up, and they're like, "Oh, I'm not fit enough to start." Like. 
You don't need to be fit to start. You just come in and start. That's how you get fit. All right, listen. It's simple. We'll have to recreate the fight. That's awesome, man. Hey, do whatever style interests you the most. That's the most important thing. If you enjoy it, that's all that matters. Oh, jeez. First, he was in cover behind the barricade. Get down behind that barrier. Good. I want you to put some bullets in a few things. What do we got? Oh, what's this? Okay. Oh, that's cool. You just cover shot. By now, <laughs> right? Ah, but they won't. If they're a good trainer, they won't. That's why I love. Uh, I love one championship. If you guys have seen much one championship, whoops. Just because they, they really promote the respect and the humbleness uh, that comes along with the martial arts, right? Ooh. Oh, headshot, yes. Firing shots from the passenger window. But he couldn't get a clean shot, so he pushed forward. Hey, Shiz, what's going on, bud? I was wondering when you'd come out. Oh. Did you watch the UFC on the weekend? Yeah, the karate combat's really good, dude. I like that. I really like the respect that they show. Whoa, what am I doing? Oh. Move it a long way. We don't have a lot of time. Jeez, he's a bit of a bullet sponge, isn't he? He would have tried to get away, but Charlie disabled the car. <laughs> Your weapon, officer. You were missed, Shiz. Good firing way. Right? Pendul! What are you doing? I told you he wasn't important. Now he oh, is. jeez. He's going to help us this guy's brutal, man. He's worse than the gangsters. A good way. You understand? I don't think I do, sir. Way, I know who you are. You're just like me. Uh, oh, thanks, Martin. Must be oh, done. Luke. <laughs> I was reading the last name in my head and said it out loud. You should go. I would love to try Salat. Uh, apparently, there is a school in Vancouver. So that is one that I would love to go and check out. Uh, hopefully, they will let me film a private lesson. Cause I think that'd be really cool to go learn. Oh, I'm glad you're able to, to learn now. I'm glad you're able to learn now, mate. Oh, okay, I didn't realize I had the cops on me. Go! Dude, that uh, Ortega Volkanovski fight was insane. Just nuts. That guillotine that, uh, that that Ortega threw up was crazy. What's up, Daniel? Ooh. You're making me hungry now too, Alicia. Yeah, but if you're ever in town, drop on in. I'd love to have you guys come and try out a class. Ooh. Oh. Oh, I missed the exit. Come on. And there we go, and we good. Whoop. <laughs> it did, like I said, guys, if uh, if any of you guys are ever in town, you're always welcome. Which one's that? Mucha Lucha? Oh, I feel feel like I do. Oh. Yes, I think he is. He is one of the guys who is absolutely as legit as he looks in the movies, man. Uh, I'm in BC. So I'm on the west coast there. 
Oh, can we get off the highway? Oh, oh. Hey, getting pretty good at this driving thing now. Hopefully I don't speak too soon. Yeah, British Columbia. Uh, no, I haven't seen- there's a sumo anime? Actually, I've heard about that one. Yeah, you do. That's the thing with Salat. Any of those, like, um, fancy styles, right? Is anything with anything that's a little bit fancy. Like, to me, an effective martial art is something that is simple and works um, with, like, the less training it needs. The less training it needs. Um, <laughs> <gasps> ah! The less training something requires for you to be able to look after yourself, that will make that's what makes an effective martial art, in my books anyway. Ooh, meatballs! You guys are really making me hungry now. Yeah, Salat is a very brutal-looking style. I'd love to learn more about it for sure. I would absolutely love to learn more about it. But that's uh, one of the reasons that I love Muay Thai. A solid leg kick? <laughs> I know, it's because I'm looking at the chat down here. And then looking up at the game up here. Dude, you're a strongman athlete? That's awesome. That's why I like Muay Thai. Because an elbow or, an, or a knee or a low kick is really simple and very, very effective. Dude, Strongman is so cool. I love watching the Strongman competitions. What those guys do is nuts. Oh, out of my way. Jiu Jitsu is like simple enough to learn a few basic moves, but it's it gets really complicated really fast. <laughs> Right, Shiz? Those, uh, those fights were nuts, man. I was a bit disappointed with Nate, but I thought he fought really well. Uh, so my primary studies, I've uh, done Shotokan for about 10 years. I've done Muay Thai for about 14, and I've done Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu for 7. Uh, and I would like, you know, I've done, I've done a little bit of, like, Gokan Ru and other things like that as well. But uh, Muay Thai and Brazilian Jiu Jitsu are my, my big ones now. You can't be serious. You trying to solve Hinomaru Sumo? Is it on Crunchyroll? Then I'll take it. Easy. Fine. It's your funeral. But I'd love to learn judo and I would love to learn wrestling. I actually have a wrestling. Uh, coach training at my gym, and I want to get them to teach. Oh, how do I plant the bug? What am I doing here? I'll be honest with you guys, I have absolutely no idea. Ah, okay, we're just standing at the wrong side of the car. <laughs> ah. Uh, I've had to use my training once, and it was honestly the scariest moment I've ever been through in my entire life. I try and avoid uh, conflict if I can. Where is this thing? Oh, there we go. There we go. Uh, no, um... So, we were out with some friends, and then uh, these like six guys walk past, grab my friend's girlfriend's chest. Um, so my friend walked up to him, tapped him on the shoulder, said, hey, what's up? The guy turned around, swung, hit him in the head. My friend tackled him to the floor, and then there was three of us and six of them. Luckily, it got broken up in about 10 or 15 seconds, because it was right outside a police station. So it got broken up really fast. 
But uh, yeah, my friend ended up getting kicked in the head while he was on the ground and was in hospital for three days with concussion. Oh. There we go. Uh, it was honestly, it was like three in the morning. We'd all been drinking. Um, one of the guys was about to kick my friend while he was uh, tackling the other dude. So I tackled him. We went down a flight of stairs uh, that led down to a bar, and then the police ended up breaking it up. So it was, um, it was not technical at all. It was just, um, just a brutal, awful, awful situation. So, like I said, I love, I love fighting, I love sparring, I love getting hit in the head, it's great fun. Um, but in a controlled environment. Not, um, not, not on the street, not at all. I do like the Diaz brothers, Nate and Nick are absolute legends. No, real life fighting looks, real life fighting looks nothing like, um, the UFC at all just like like movie fighting looks nothing like real fighting either that's the thing right people sometimes get upset like in the comments they're like oh I was expecting more of a breakdown on the movie but it's also like movie fighting looks nothing like real fight. like sport fighting is nothing like movie fighting right because there's setups there's tells, there's everything. In a movie fight, shit just happens because it looks cool, right? There's no real rhyme or reason behind it. Oh, Cole Tang. There we go. Yes. Inspector, it's way. Whoops. A long time to become like Tony Ja, man. That guy yeah. is nuts. He is One insane other. at what he does. Yeah, right. Oops. I'll, okay, I okay. You know what? I'm gonna after tonight. I'm gonna go and get a Crunchyroll subscription. No, I agreed to help you, Inspector, but not if it gets me killed. Yeah, and like when I say that, when I say that as well, I'm not uh, discrediting what those guys do either. Like, please don't take it as that. Like, oh, those guys can't really fight. Um, you know, they're they're amazing at what they do, right? They have a very, very specific set of skills. Like, there's no way that I could ever do what they do. Ever. But, I'm pretty sure I could set up... Uh, probably I might be able to set up a better low kick than a few of them, right? They were good, dude. I would say, out of Eco Uice and Tony Jar, oh, that's a really tough one, actually. Yeah, Donnie Yen knows everything, but Donnie Yen is insane. I think I would say Tony Jar as well. Mr. Miyagi is like, that's what I want to be. I want to be an old man. So I have, I have three different stages that I want to go through in life. I want to go through the fighting stage, which is what I'm doing now. Where I'm lean, I'm fit, I'm strong, I feel good. Um, whoops, get out. Um, I want to go through that stage, and then if anyone here knows Trainer Guy uh, on Instagram, or even like Coach uh, Coach Kirian from CSA, those like coaches with the big bellies, but are just rock hard, I want to be that when I'm like 40. That's my like 40-year uh, goal, and then when I'm 50 or 60, I want to be like Mr. Miyagi, that just super zen old dude who no one messes with. Those are the three stages I want. Fight, fat, and then wise. <laughs> yeah, Jujutsu Kaisen was great. I did watch that one. Actually, I did, uh, I subscribed to Crunchyroll specifically for Jujutsu Kaisen uh, a few months ago, and it was sick. It was so good. Yeah, every time I say Crunchyroll, it makes me hungry too, Abra. Oh. 
Uh, no, I don't. But hey, anime week is just around the corner, so maybe we'll uh, we'll do some Jujutsu Kaisen ones. <laughs> I'm thirty. I'm thirty now, Larry. Um, I think so. I think I know. I haven't watched it in ages. I will have to rewatch it. But uh, the one where Gojo Satoru fights the Lava Head guy, that was a beautiful fight. <laughs> I know, I'm actually, I'm old, dude, I'm 30. I have so many students that like, have careers, have their lives together, have kids, and I find out they're younger than me, I'm like, oh no, I'm getting old. Oh jeez. <laughs> ah. <laughs> We're getting old, Zell. No, like, I legit have people like, who have families and stuff, and they're like 28. And then, uh... You know, we get to talking, I'm like, oh, geez, you're so much more mature than me. Here I am, still trying to chase my martial arts dream, avoiding having a real job by teaching Muay Thai. <laughs> no worries, geez. it's fun to have someone to talk to fights with. Especially because I know you're a big Nick Diaz fan, so I thought I'd give you a shout out and see if how, how excited you were. <laughs> Dude, every time I hit the ground and like have to get back up, I'm like, ugh. Everything cracks. I have to work out what else I'm going to do while I'm down there because it's too hard to stand up or sit down anymore. <laughs> uh. Right? Dude, I am actually in way better shape now than I was in my 20s. I'll be honest with you. So much better shape. Oh, is she, I bet she's an absolute monster. Learning kickboxing in the Ukraine, I bet she's amazing. Oh, that young chick? Yeah. Punches the, like, bark off trees and stuff. Oh, I'll bet. Capoeira be, uh, it make you strong in all sorts of weird places, right? It's actually amazing for, uh, jiu-jitsu. Capoeira is an amazing cross-training for jiu-jitsu. If you guys know, uh, Cobrinha, um, he's, uh, like, a capoeira, like, uh, master, whatever it is, like Black Sash or something, uh, whatever it is, but he's now like an 11 time Brazilian Jiu Jitsu world champion and he owes a lot of it to his capoeira skills. Dude, she studied kickboxing and now she's a doctor? That's awesome. Two of our people were killed and a couple customers were wounded. The police are there now. Wait, wait, you went after your family? Capoeira Easter. Everyone's outside. Yeah, Eddie Gordo or uh, Christy Montero. Listen up. We're hitting a switch. Uh, I haven't rewatched their old stuff yet. But uh I think Douglas Lima. I just I'm going to go against you, Shiz. I know you're going to pick MVP, so I'm going to pick Douglas Lima. Ah. Do doctors work an insane amount? Fucking sure. I don't know how they have time to do anything else. Oh, cool. Dentists are even cooler, man. They make even more money than doctors. It's insane. A good friend of mine is a dentist. Dentists are very good uh, friends to have. If it was anyone else other than Anderson Silva, I would have been like, Sh stop, stop what you're doing and fight. But it's Anderson Silva, so, I mean, he's going to do whatever Anderson Silva wants to do, man. Oh, oh, I didn't realize I was driving. I thought I was on the wrong side of the car. I love Anderson Silva. Did you guys see Anderson Silva fight this weekend on one championship? Let's see what you can do without iron. Look, hold on. It's a different Anderson Silva, by the way. He's a super heavyweight. He just has the same name. He fought uh, Marcus Puchesha, who is a 17-time Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu world champion, who just had his first MMA fight. This game's fun, although it is very hard to do while trying to keep a hold of chat. 
<laughs> some bodies on you before the night is over. I want to see proof that you're not a cop. Oh, it was uh, it was Bichesha. Yeah, no, it's uh, his name's Anderson. His name's Anderson Silva. It got me too. See you, Andre. Have a good night, man. Thanks for coming to hang out. Griffin and Bonner was like the fight that made MMA uh, as popular as it is. Train really hard, she is, if you want to be like him, for sure. But uh, yeah, no, I've been promising Camillo I would do only the strong for ages, so I'm gonna have to get on that. Oh, there's just such a big weight class difference there, though. That's the only thing, right? No, never think you're in an anime. <laughs> even they, even the way they run an anime is ridiculous. It's so much fun, though. And I have definitely tried to go Super Saiyan. Oh, whoops! Sorry, lady. Yeah, but I mean, Fedor being like as good as he is and as big as he is. And that's the thing, like, it's different classes, right? Like, Fedor is the same class as Anderson Silva, but just much bigger. <clears throat> it's like when Anderson Silva fought DC. It was ridiculous. DC just grabbed him, threw him to the floor, and destroyed him. Not gonna give this guy a chance. Yes. Can you run him into anything? Ah, uh, this will do. So the thing, um, if you ever want to see like little guy fight big guys, check out uh, Knockweed Davy. Check out Knockweed Davy. <laughs> Dragon Ball Z fights are like, would be so ridiculous to react to though, because it's just, you can't see anything a lot of the time. Uh, oh, I'll show you in a second, X Modus. Dude, remember that time that Fedor got slammed on his head by Kevin Randleman and then submitted him? Like, that was insane. That's still one of my favorite highlight clips to show people. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, another golden nerf gun. Someone's. Oh, um. Oh, who was that who submitted Butterbean? I can't remember who that was. I loved Super, though. Super was amazing. Oh, headshot. Yes. Oh, nope. Nope. Get, get out of here quick. Hide, hide, hide. That almost went really badly. Jeez. Yeah, I think Khabib might still be uh, pound for pound best. I, I'm, I want to say Nate, but I feel like Connor. Oh. Yes. I like the whole slow mo vault thing. Reminds me of uh, Max Payne. Really? Brock Lesnar's coming back? Dude, he's on so much juice. How on earth is he gonna like, clear Usada? Jeez. 
Jeez, these guys are resilient. How many times do I have to shoot this guy? Oh, not coming back. Oh, okay. I mean, he did get submitted by Frank Mir. I remember. Didn't Bobby Lashley used to be in the WWE and he used to work with um, the like little Irish midget? Yeah, remember Uberim? Do you guys remember Uberim from back in the K1 days? Yeah, I yes, I mean, I just watched Dragon Ball Super and watched uh, the Tournament of Power arc, and then Dragon Ball Super Broly was incredible. Just an absolutely visually beautiful. Hey, Nibe. Dude, I'm so bad at fighting games. I'm awful at them. The only one I've, like, was somewhat okay at was uh, Dragon Ball Super. That was it. <laughs> uh, oh, we're gonna just chase him down the stairs. Oh no, he's getting away. Oh, oh jeez. I cannot see a thing. Why am I smoking? <laughs> ah. Oh. Whoops. Oh. I did, yeah, though. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Oh, dude, that sliding Kamehameha against Kepler was, might be one of the dopest things I've ever seen. Jeez, this guy's slow. Come on, dude. Huh? I had to wait for him to get past me just so I could catch him. Oh. Dude, that was embarrassing. He should never have been allowed in there. At all. What? I held... Oh. I see what I did. <laughs> ah. I'm not chasing you, I'm waiting for you. Because I keep messing up the damn buttons. Right? I, I wonder if my internet could handle me playing some Dragon Ball Fighters. That was like, that was such an embarrassing fight for everybody. Okay. Press circle. There we go, now we got it. Dude, Cell Saga was so good. I really need to rewatch Dragon Ball Z to be honest. <laughs> oh. Yeah, the, Wu, uh, the Wukong outfit is like actual police uniform in Hong Kong, right? That's what they wear. Wait, what? I have to action hijack? What? Hold X when close to target. Press X when arrow turns green. Yes! Yes. Are you fucking done? Okay, okay. Oh, okay.
You know what? Uh, I've never actually seen Dragon Ball abridged. Reagan has, and she keeps telling me we need to watch it. The uh, Big Bang Super Command, Big Bang Command Maya times a hundred in GT was pretty dope. What are you doing? Shut up! You know what you just did? You're dead! You're dead! Look, I'm not afraid of dog eyes. Dog eyes? Motherfucker, I get paid by dog eyes. Uh, oh, my yeah, God. my fiance. We're basically married. You wanna fuck with him? I just did. Sometimes I call her my wife, sometimes I call her my fiance. I mix it up a little bit, keep her guessing, you know? Oh, oh man. I don't give a shit about your product. When you keep talking about it, I'm liable to forget I promised to bring you in alive. What the hell is wrong with you? You know what? I'm sick of listening to you. So drop me off with some real She does, she fights. Well, you'll get to meet a few. Yeah, Reagan fights. Used to be this organization knew what he was doing. Now it's full of crazy motherfuckers and choir boys. <sighs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> we don't go near the monks anymore, Shiz. That was <laughs> See you. Nice to motherfucking me. From tonight on, your partnership with Dog Guys is done. Yeah, uh. Take a run. Gohan was a letdown, to be honest. Like, in Super, he really was a letdown. I expected so much more from him. Yeah. Gohan, like. I know Akira Toriyama wanted. Uh. Wanted Gohan to take over from Goku after Cell, but then they just brought Goku back. Hey, man. I don't do this often, but, uh, Wait, me get some tattoos? Sorry, I was wrong about me? That. Or like in the game get tattoos? Tonight, yeah, Super Saiyan 2? Oh, dude, that, that one arm, one arm Kamehameha against Cell at the end of the saga? Oh, yes. <laughs> Just full body tattoos, head to toe. I have some tattoos I'd like to get. I'm just not like, ah, I don't know, I haven't committed to them yet. Alright, what do we got? Cop upgrades, what are we going for here? Alright, we're going for the police trunky, there we go. And then, extra hijack damage, or extra ramming damage, yep. Vegeta's the best. No, I haven't seen the, the uh, Team 4 star version of any of them yet. I did see that. That's hilarious. Dylan Dennis needs to just, like... I don't like Dylan Dennis at all. Yeah, but Vegeta's just a badass. Should we see if my internet will uh, keep up with playing some Dragon Ball Fighters? I don't know why I stole this person's car. I don't even know where we're going. Where are we going? Oh, what's this? Available missions, go to bed. That sounds actually like a perfect place to stop. <laughs> I can't deal with that embarrassment right now, Zell. I can't get schooled in front of in front of uh, everybody. Where do we go to bed? Right. There. No, here. No, there it is. Home. Okay. Jeez. Dude, Vegeta's just a badass, man. He's a badass all the time. My dog is 
Ah. Oh, really? Why is that? Why aren't you allowed to get tattoos in your culture? Get out of here. Oh, let's not run him into the wall till we're out of here. There we go. Ah, okay, that makes sense. Get out of here, bud. Let's be nice. Yeah, he's gone back to almost being a villain, hasn't he? I think I saw something about in the manga. He's like, um, going back to like being one of Goku's main rivals or something. I mean, he always is, but I haven't kept up with the manga, so I don't know. Manga? <laughs> ah. Yes, I do think it looks bad if a professional MMA fighter gets beaten by a doorman. Oh. When, uh... When, um... When Beerus slaps Bulma and Vegeta just goes nuts. Like, Vegeta's a better husband, let's be fair here. Vegeta's a way better husband than Goku's ever been. And dad, too. Oh, he has a God of War tattoo? That's cool. Bulma's a genius. Oh, the... Yeah, was it Logan Paul versus Mayweather? was just a garbage fight. Jake Paul versus Tyrone Woodley was so much... So bad, too. Just a terrible fight. Dude, even, like, Mayweather afterwards was like, who else makes $150 million doing a fake fight? Jeez. Yes, I'm super excited for God of War Ragnarok. Crazy excited for that. I mean, they're doing a lot of good things for, like, bringing attention to fighters' pay. Like, that's a good thing. I think they'll be good for fighters in overall. They're not good fighters, but they'll be good for them. <gasps> Reagan's home. Alright. And I think that considering our last objective was go to bed, I might have to call it there as well. Because <laughs> uh, it is getting a bit late. Yeah, I don't like the Paul brothers at all, but uh, yeah. Hey. <laughs> Dude, Tyrone just looked terrible. Tyrone just looked so bad on his feet. Like, he was just circling. He was following Jake around the whole time. He got that one good shot. He got a couple of good shots. Um, but then it was just like... He just followed him around. That was it. It was terrible. No jabs, no fakes, nothing. It was garbage. <laughs> That, I would like to see that. Nate and Nick versus Logan and Jake. That's a good one. That's a good tattoo. I want to get one with uh, the five rings of Miyamoto Musashi. That's what I want to get. And I want to get one that's uh, an Australian flag with a bear in front of it. I'll have to check that out. I haven't seen his ones. Alright, Zell. We will. We will. I promise, buddy. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't get a tattoo of my face. <laughs> That's a terrible idea. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, that would be sick. A dragon tattoo on the back would be cool. Alright, last one. Last one, Shiz. Who's gonna win between you and me? It's you. Okay? 100%. Jorge Masvidal. I hope. I hope. At least Jorge Masvidal is like a decent striker. Tyrone Woodley is not a good striker. <laughs> I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Tony Jar is amazing. That guy is incredible. He's actually one of the reasons I started training in Muay Thai. Uh, when he was in Ong Bak. Ooh, I actually like that, Camillo. I really like that a lot. 
That one might have to go into the maybe pile. But, uh, yeah. Alright, guys. <laughs> oh, dude, that's awesome. I'm glad, uh, I'm glad that, you know, I could help be a part of inspiring you to train. I am. You gotta let me know how it goes, okay? Two more weeks, dude. Two more weeks, you can get back to it. Two more weeks, you can get into it, start learning, start training. Yes, there's my lovely fiance who knows about Dragon Ball Abridged. <laughs> I love Dragon Ball Abridged. Yeah, they said you're a unicorn. Why? Because you like Dragon Ball Abridged. It's hilarious. See? <laughs> yeah. Stop At least she just said it's hilarious as well. So you and Alicia are on the same wavelength. Oh yeah, yeah, 100%. <laughs> we can talk about it tomorrow, Alicia. <laughs> <laughs> everyone says hi. Hi, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Okay. Oh. What? I have ten minutes left to eat. Can you do? <laughs> all right, guys. I'm gonna go as well. I'm gonna go sign up for Crunchyroll so I can watch some anime tonight. All right, guys. Thanks so much for coming to hang out. It's been fun. We will. Uh, do this again Tuesday next week. Okay? Tuesday next week. <laughs> night, guys. Have a good one. Stay awesome. Have a great night. Bye. <laughs>